Hi, my name is Andrea Gibbons and I wanted to share with you our top practical tips from our Evidence for Quality Improvement session this morning at the Fab Change 20 conference. So number one, join the Q community. Absolutely incredible resource, a fantastic network of people working in some capacity in the QI world. You can join one of the many special interest groups even as a non-member. Even better, it's all free. Number two, check out the evidence for quality improvement of Pinterest boards at pinterest.co.uk forward slash e for QI. On those boards you will find a stack of resources and an absolute wealth of freely available links to quality improvement research resources and evidence so do please check that out and if there's something you'd like us to add do let us know at evidence for qi on twitter number three save a link on your desktop to the qi monthly evidence updates the link for that tinyurl.com forward slash qi monthly you can also find those on the academy of fabulous stuff in those QI monthly evidence updates, you will find a quick recap and links to all the latest QI related evidence and news events and funding opportunities that you need to know about if you work in QI. Number four, meet your library team, make them your friends, invite them to QI training and incorporate them as extended members of your QI team. The value that they can add to your QI projects is immeasurable if you just create the opportunity to open that dialogue. Number five, request a QI literature search from your library. Now it may sound dry to ask for literature, but what you're really asking for is what's going on elsewhere. What does best practice look like? Who else has done something similar? And what can you learn from other organisations tackling the same type of problems as you are? So do give it a go, visit your library and ask if they can help you with a literature or evidence search. And finally, it's Fab Change Day. So of course, don't forget to share your QI work on the Academy of Fabulous Stuff. And when you start a new project, check out the Academy website as you may well find resources, stories and contacts on there that you can use for your QI project. Thank you.